Welcome back Stingers and welcome to the first ever tarot card series on my channel. Seven readings in seven days. Are you excited? <laughs> Today's topic is love. Some of you guys are in a relationship, looking for a relationship, falling out of a relationship, hoping for a relationship. I'm going to see what the cards have for you. We got the Nine of Swords and the Six of Cups. Some of you guys are in fear. You're scared. There's a relationship that may be coming back from the dead, honey, from the past, and you don't trust it. You're scared that maybe this person is not um, telling the truth or they're coming back for a specific reason that is unsavory. Uh, and it's coming in pretty fast. You know, um, I would definitely be a little weary, take your time, um, figure things out. Uh, there may be some confusion there with you. And um, I'm seeing a lot of coins. We're seeing money. Maybe you broke up because of money. Maybe they had no damn money. Maybe they took your damn money. Maybe this person was dishonest about money. Um, you know, I do see, uh, something new coming up as well. So a lot of you guys have the energy of maybe an ex coming back. Um, but also a new situation happening as well, you know, and, um, you may be coming out of something, trying to get over your ex and boom, here comes somebody new in the midst. Wow. So we have the King of Wands and the Five of Swords. This is definitely the new person, the new, um, it, it may be a new opportunity, but I do see it as, as uh, a door opening for um, a, an intimate relationship. This is somebody who is very powerful and strong and they, they're employed, honey. But um, I don't think you're ready for that. I think there you still have some negative thinking going on. And, um, you know, maybe with time, you'll be able to open those doors, maybe with time. Let me see what sign this person may be. So we got two people going on in here. We got an ex that you, you don't want anything to do with, and I don't blame you, honey. And then we got somebody new peeping in. But you don't trust that either, actually. You don't trust that either. But I do, I do believe that if you give it some time, it will be a good opportunity. Let me see what sign this person may be. We got an Aries energy. That explains the chariot rushing in. That explains that that explains it. This may be the X. I think that's the X, honey. Let me see if they have a message for you here. I'm becoming a better person. That's that damn ex, honey. They coming back. You don't trust it. And they're rushing in. They got Aries energy. So they have no, no red light. And um, you don't trust it. There's something that happened financially with them. Maybe you were the one spending money on them. They took your money. They were dishonest about it. There was some, some, some confusion with that. Okay? There was some confusion with that. But I see a new situation. I see somebody new, somebody responsible. But I don't, I don't think you trust it. I think, you know, um, you're, you're still thinking about this past situation. But I do believe with time that it could be something new. And it could be something, something um, somebody that will help you build here. All right, guys. That's all I have for you today. I'll see you soon.